we're a few days before game day with Stoke, uh, which is where we're going to come back on the 4th of December. Uh, but after we left off um, with Swansea, 2-2 two -two draw with Petersboro, Harvey White, Marin Pills with the goals. This was a funny one. Um, we drew nil-nil with Fulham, and right after the game, Scott Parker was fired. <laughs> <laughs> so that was pretty funny. And uh, Cardiff, we beat 2 0. I was hoping Frank Lambert, uh, oh, that's a, he, he's at Chelsea. Oh, well. Uh, if it would have been Frank Lambert and he would have got fired, that would have been hilarious, too. Uh, but Adam Ida, uh, a two minute brace, actually a one minute brace. Um, excellent, excellent performance. So we're coming back for Stoke. The reason I came back here. Uh, if we hop into uh, staff and job security, uh, you can see a lot of a lot of top level teams, including Tottenham. Uh, well, is Crystal Palace really a big team? Schalke, they're a big team. Uh, but anyway, a lot of teams up here. Den Haag. This one just happened, right there. It's available. They did fire their manager. Uh, they're sitting in 12th position, and they were supposed to finish 5th. Uh, remember, we're supposed to get relegated. So Liam Cooper, still the captain. Luke Ayling, the vice captain. Helder Costa, key player. Hot prospect, Jamie Wood, 17 years old. Eh, not a bad little striker. He's got... You know, some holes in his game, but who doesn't, right? Who doesn't? But uh, let's see. Senior squad. I just want to kind of see who's still there. Eh. Will Huffer's still there? Wow. Cooper, Ailing, Lawrence DeBach, Robbie Gotts, Stuart Dallas. Got Stuart Dallas is unregistered? Really? Interesting. Uh, Alioski is still there. McCalmont, he's 21 now. Looks like he's broken into the starting lineup. Treore, Click is there. He's coming off the bench now. Uh, Pills, of course, is the guy we have on loan. Jordan Stevens, Bogic, McCarron, Elder Costa, Bamford. Three goals off the bench. Mujica, that must be their main, no, Santa Bria, don't know who he is, eight goals in 17, that's not bad, came over from Genoa, from the Barcelona system, and AS Roma, not bad, not bad, um, I have not declared interest in the job, uh, but if they offer it, I might take it, guys. I might take it. We'll see. I just wanted to let you guys know what was happening. Full disclosure. All right. Well, we'll be back for Stoke in just a second. Well, hey, guys. RC here. Back with episode 22, Football Manager 20, our Forest Green Save. For the time being, Leeds has not reached out to us. We do not appear to be on their radar. I'm not going to declare interest in the job. I don't want to, you know, tweak things. But uh, anyway, we're back for Stoke, who just had, uh, uh, I think their manager got fired, too. I could be wrong about that. Um, but here we are. We're going with pretty much the same lineup. I am putting Tatia in the goal. Uh, he is, uh, you may remember, our new free signing. He is our reserve keeper. Came over from Chelsea system. But uh, need to get him some playing time. He's 20 years old. He's pretty good. So we do need him to play a little bit. So we're going to put him in the game today. Um, you know what? Let's put Freer. I want to give him a start. I'm going to put Hunter up top couple of rotations just you know give some guys some extra playing time try to keep players happy hopefully it doesn't backfire i'm always leery of this 
Oh, T makes a save and early goal. Oh, and offsides, Nathan Collins. Oh, yeah, there's four guys offsides, and it wasn't even close. So thank goodness for that. Um, can we get creative? Can you, can you concentrate? That would be nice. All right, they're inspired. That's good. All right, we're dominating performance. Possession. Here's white into the box. Echo bear into white crossed in and in a bocker i don't know how to pronounce that in a but in a bocker it's close you're going to get a different pronunciation each time i think just because of the, the name but he comes in after taking the set piece and is at the back post to put it away so we're happy with that get in at halftime here a little bit of stoppage all right we haven't really i'm gonna take off work ball into box just to see if that helps us a little bit hunter's playing a six five so i think he's gonna come off here rather quickly yep he's dropped let's go ahead and pull uh Pull Ida back on. Actually, you know what? Let's rest him a little longer. Let's bring Collins on and Nico Williams for Dominic Ball. He's on a yellow. Demand more. All right, we're starting to put some shots, but they're not on target. Uh, let's see. Let's pop into the tactic. Let's put our slow pace down. Let's do a regroup if we lose possession. And let's see. Collins can play both sides here. We're going to bring Ida on. All right. Let's tell him to tighten up. Oh, my goodness. That almost didn't have enough pace on it, did it? Collins into the box. Cleared away. And another corner. I need to check my corners. I've started playing around with them a little bit. And yeah, that, that tells me right there that I need to adjust those. All right, there is our move. Oh, nice hustle there. Oh, wow, I thought we were going to have that. Play it through, and a shot, Adam Ida. His eighth of the season. What an assist by Ineka in Bakari. I don't know. What do we call him? You guys have a name that we can rename him that might be, or tell me how to pronounce it, in a Bakar, in a Bakari. But I don't know. Let's come up with a nickname for him because I'm 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 gonna struggle with that all season. Now, if we go to Leeds, it won't matter. But you know, two nil, comfortable win, excellent effort, good job. All right, well, we'll be right back for Preston, and I am going to tweak those. Oh, shutout on his debut. Nice. I'm going to praise him. Seven unbeaten in a row. Nice. All right, we'll be right back, and I'm going to tweak those corners as well. All right, we are back for Preston. Let's pop into uh, the job security real quick. I don't think, uh, well, let's see, it would be Job Center, right? Maybe. So, Leeds. And I don't think we're going to go anywhere but England. So, let's take these out. And we will turn that off and repop England. There we go. 
All right, so Leeds, Nuno Espirito Santo. Yeah, he's a three and a half star. I'm just barely or just under a three star. Yeah, just un a hair under a three star. So he would probably be the better match. Fair enough. But uh, didn't even get a call. So, oh well. Let's go back here. There we are. All right. Submit the team. So we've been on a run of form. You saw right at the end of last game, we were, what, seven unbeaten? A lot of, uh, you know, a couple of draws in there, but it is what it is. We've got uh, O'Malley back in the goal. But you got to be a little enthusiastic about a, uh, a, a clean sheet in your debut. White, Adams, Pills. I tell you what, that midfield trio is really good. And, oh, he was looking back post Collins, and it just goes wide. All right, let's get a little creativity. Pressure. Oh, my God, McKay beats two, two players. A uh, little lay down, and that goes high on the volley. Come on, boys. Do better. Do better. Demand more. All right, apprehensive, pressured. Let's get a nice counter here if we can. And Ida turns the corner after stealing it. He doesn't have anybody, and that's that was not, not good. Let's take a look at the tactic here real quick. All right, we do have work ball into the box. Yeah, I don't have that on, so that's good. Just checking, just checking a few things. Show some passion. Oh, nice steal by Pills. Ida's into the box and knocked away by Rudd. A good save. Another good chance goes wanting. Eight on target. No chances created, though. Ouch. All right, you guys are playing well. No cards, so that's positive. Let's get some early creativity. Wharton into the box. Adams resets the offense. We go back to O'Malley. Build from the back again. Try to draw him out. Ida's on the receiving end. There's one back door, and Aaron Collins does not miss this one. His fourth of the season. Ida with the assist, and we have a 1 0 advantage in the 48th minute. Really, really dominating this game statistically, but we know that that means exactly jack squat, right? White plays it through. Ida backdoors it. <clears throat> uh, we deserve something out of that one. That was a nice through ball. Very nice through ball. Williams comes up on that, but it dies. All right, defense builds it up again. Looking forward to hearing some suggestions from you guys on an, on a name for that guy. <laughs> oh, deflected there. Oh my God, how did that not go in? How did that not go in? That was a brilliant ball to the midfielder. And I think we got a penalty there. No, it looks like Rawson was called for the foul. Uh, let's see. Anybody? Nobody's really struggling. 
Let's go ahead and pull Wharton off. Well, you know what? No, we're not going to do that. Let's let them go a little bit longer. I'm going to sub Wharton off. But I'm going to wait for him to go under 70. White Adams, nice ball over the top to in Bacare, and he goes near post. All right, let's pull that sub here. Um, he is on the right side. Let's bring Hunter over there. Who has better crossing? Let's let's swap these two guys. And he's on the. No, no, no. That's not what I want. Yes, that is what I want. So Collins will actually be. Let's go ahead and make him a winger. So Hunter will stay wide and use his crossing ability. Collins will cut inside, use his finishing. Kind of like the idea of that. And Wharton, Wharton for Kitching, I think. Let's give him some praise. All right, White's overwhelmed. Pills. Comes right back to him. Tries it again. And Ida puts it over the bar. Nico Williams for Dominic Ball. Keep some fresh legs on that back line. And let's go in now and have the keeper slow our pace down. And we're not going to play the offsides trap still. All right, let's give them a tighten up shout. All right, they're frustrated, but you know what? If we can sneak out of here with a 1 0 win, that's three points. We dominated this game. Gee whiz. Um, I would like half chances and woodwork. I think that needs to be in there. So that, that looks a lot better. Nine chances, but only one goal, which makes it look that much worse <laughs> but we are top of the table by one point over Bristol City so that's good what are the odds can we make it three in a row can we make it three in a row and Leeds has lost two of their last three Bristol City dropped one Watford is in good form I bet Miles is happy about that Pills, five dribbles, five key passes. So let's praise his passing. Uh, we brought this guy in on trial uh, just to look at him. Uh, not bad. He, I think he could be a striker for us. And he's nine, but he's 19. And we really don't have the budget yet or the training facilities to really develop youth players. So, I mean, we're still basic. I mean, we have got to get on some financial footing. And you can see we're bleeding money out. I mean, I probably need to be at about $3.8 right now to be trying to break even. I mean, we'd have to shave off $40,000. Is there anybody that we can try to get rid of that's not, not playing a lot? I mean, Shepard's not. We could move him. That's 351 right there. But he's injured. He's unhappy. Ashley Hunter, we could move him. I could live without him. Because we still have Collins up there. And then we also have uh, Tite, who's 19. So I think we could do without Hunter. I mean, he is playing a lot. You know, we're giving him a lot of game time. Ricci. I mean, that's another guy we might look at moving in January. So there's there's a few guys. Is there anybody wanted against a teammate? Happy with his head coach's treatment of Liam Shepard. Wow. Uh, he's wanted on loan. He's wanted by, for transfer. I'm probably not going to get rid of McGinley. I, I he's, he's just one of our better players. Uh, Kitching is wanted. He has a pretty high release clause. I might have to consider lowering that release clause to transfer him, but I'm not 
I'm not going to take a hit on him. He's valued at 475, and he has a 3.7 release clause. Problem is, 3.7 is going to be somebody either in the championship, maybe, or Premier League or one of the top leagues. I don't know if we have the quality to do that. And everybody else is starting, so I don't particularly see a way to move too many people. But I have a couple of guys I think we could get rid of. Thing is, can we afford to? I mean, because we, we already have a pretty small squad. I mean, you know, we do have a couple of these lone guys that are just never going to play. I'm going to try to cancel theirs, but if I remember correctly... We're not paying anything for them, so it doesn't matter. Now we're paying a slight monthly fee. So yeah, if we could if we could terminate his loan, that would be good. Loan cannot be terminated, but he can be recalled. I guess if it can't be terminated, I can't terminate it either, huh? Well, that would be hoping for too much. Anyway, guys, I think we've done pretty well. We got uh, you know, a couple of wins there. They weren't stellar, but uh, they looked good, I guess. We're sitting on 41 points after 21 games, uh, just under that two-point-per-game mark, and I think that gets you near the top of the table in the championship. Uh, well, there's 46, so you'd be on 92 points, and I think that would be enough to get automatic promotion at two points a game. Uh, but we've got a long way to go, and there are a lot of horses in the race still. I mean, all the way down, I mean, only seven points but, you know, for Barnsley and Huddersfield, so a long way to go. Hit the like button, subscribe if you're new, leave a comment if you like what you're seeing and want to see more, and we will see you guys next episode. Have a good one. Bye.